I'll um, also speak about kind of similar topic, but I think the um, slightly different perspective on, um, on, on, on the shaping of the built environment to an integrated approach. This case, to actually what you have, what you do when you have to build. Um, and I think um, one of the things I'd like to start with is, is where do you actually start? Because you may only touched on a really interesting point, which is it all has to be done, the thinking has to be done at early stage, and, and sometimes it doesn't really start with a clear idea of where we are trying to take an opportunity. And even before it's even an opportunity, when it's actually a problem. Um, and, and the question is where do you start? And, and this diagram, I think, to me, is, is quite an interesting one, because it's all of those topics that you see on the screen that needs to be taken into account <coughs> at the same time. And sometimes it's quite a difficult thing to do. So I think us, as, as people that shape the building environment, Kind of a little bit of a responsibility um, to to engage, and, and and in that I don't mean just with the stakeholders, with the people who um, make decisions or invest in, in a certain uh, opportunity, but actually to the different difficult the different um, technical disciplines that need to be understood um, in advance, and actually evaluating the issues in an integrated way. So I think an entry point to each project is, is always. Um, quite clear because it starts with a problem. It could be an environmental issue, it could be a, uh, an issue of uh, you know, a social demographic perspective, it could be all sorts of different things that instigate um, a challenge that then transforms into an opportunity. Our challenge is how do we bring this all to a, to a holistic understanding of the challenge. And, and I'm going to take us back maybe 150 years ago, um, and it's an interesting project in the context of what we had recently, which is the pandemic. <coughs> this is the, um, the Victoria sewer system in London, uh, which was constructed, in fact, after similar conditions of, of the pandemic, after you know cholera and so forth, where where, where basically plague in the whole city of London. And um, 